Besides welcoming in a new year Friday, Florida will also have a number of new laws on the books, including a new minimum wage that is nine cents an hour higher. Here's a rundown from News Forge X reporter Jake Stofan in Tallahassee. Employers will have to begin checking the immigration status of their new hires through the federal e-verify system or by collecting I-9 forms starting January 1st. The governor earlier this year suggested it will ensure legal citizens are the first in line to be hired. That could actually be something that's even more important now given that people are going to be needing jobs. But others like the ACLU worry it will make the hiring process more difficult. Businesses don't need more obstacles right now for hiring their workforce. And that's exactly what E-Verify does. Businesses need flexibility and E-Verify ties their hands. New Year's Day will also see penalties doubled for illegally passing a school bus. Fines will be set at $200 or $400, depending on which side of the bus a driver passes. We're sending a message that we're taking this seriously. Pay attention to the roads, especially when there's young children that are going on and off of a school bus. The start of 2021 will also mark the end of greyhound racing in the state, required by a 2018 constitutional amendment that won 69% of the vote. These dogs will not have to race for their lives any longer and will be able to be regular dogs. There are 3,000 Florida jobs associated with greyhound racing, but those in the industry have had time to prepare. So they have been uh, processing the animals to adoption homes. The last greyhound racing event will take place on December 31st at the Palm Beach Kennel Club. The final race is scheduled for 11.59 p.m., just a minute before the ban goes into effect. Reporting from the state capitol, Jake Stofan, Channel 4, the local station. Most of Florida's racing greyhounds are being put up for adoption. Advocates we spoke with recommended going to PetFinder.com if you would like one of these dogs.